Hey everyone. One of the problems with Syria is that we can either let President Assad remain in charge of things, or we can force him out and let ISIS fill the power vacuum. It's a bit like in the Star Wars prequels when Liam Neeson helped destroy that big droid army, but then he died and Jar Jar Binks became a senator. Maybe we could force Assad out, have an election in Syria, and the Russians definitely won't try to rig it with the hundreds of personnel they have all over the country. If you've ever been to a carnival and watched a stallholder supergluing the coconuts to the stand before opening for business, that's basically an analogy for how Vladimir Putin would organise a, quote, free and fair Syrian election. Nonetheless, this week saw the US, UK and France begin a bombing campaign, supposedly in retaliation for a chemical weapons attack by Assad, but largely because there's loads of domestic problems at home and everyone needs a distraction for the weekend. In the US, former FBI director James Comey's been doing all the rounds with a big primetime Sunday night interview and presumably a later appearance on an episode of Sesame Street brought to you by the letter P. In the UK, Theresa May always needs something new to keep people occupied when Brexit threatens to make its way onto the news agenda. And in France, there's a big walkout by the SNCF rail workers, so they're essentially distracting from a rail strike with a missile strike. In reality, the whole Syrian fight really just comes down to two rival plans to bring oil and gas into Europe via Syria, one's led by the Americans and one's led by the Russians. Unless, of course, you're a momentum supporter, in which case it's all about Israel, because why not? Of course ISIS are run by Mossad, and Rupert Murdoch is personally in charge of dictating UK foreign policy, and the Rothschilds were responsible for Ed Sheeran or Ed Miliband or David Miliband. I get them all mixed up, to be honest. Anyway, see you next week. If you like these, click subscribe. Bye.